Lee Phillips is talking about wheelchairs for Christy, ALS patients. We used the segways until Christy couldn't stand. And in between that time, she'd stand and she'd sit, and we'd uh, use it at different places. But we bought one of these cheap transports. They're only about $100. And they have the legs that uh, go on them. If I can figure out how to do it, I haven't used it for a while. And so you can put the person in the wheelchair, put their feet down, and pull it apart and they can sit in it and go pretty good. It's just a cheap wheelchair but it worked very well. It's a transport, has to be pushed, but an ALS patient can't roll their own wheelchair like somebody who's just lost the use of their legs and still has good use of their upper body. So we used this for a while and we would transport her in it. It fits easily into the car and like I say, it's a hundred bucks, it's not a big deal. We'd take it on the airplane with us, and the airplane is professional at breaking the arms off. They will buy you new arms when they break them off. Want to ask me how I know? So, uh, in fact, they have an entire division that just orders wheelchair parts because they break them on the airplanes. So we used it, it worked great, and we loved it as long as it did what it was supposed to do for Christy, but she ultimately grew out of that one. The reason they grow out of them is, is they can't sit up straight anymore. So we went to another wheelchair that has the capacity to tip her back, and we used that one for a while. I'll show you that one in a minute. This is Lee Phillips talking about the succession of wheelchairs that Christy got.